How's it going, everybody? It's Michael from theloftestparty.com, and I hope you're doing fantastico. I also hope you'll subscribe, and then I hope you'll click like, and then hit that bell button so you don't miss a notification when there's a new video. These are just some of my hopes. I can't share them all right now because this video isn't about that. It's about a new story that is a great example of why I can't stand big government. Because here's what happens. When there's a big government program or a policy, it's almost impossible to get rid of no matter how idiotic it is. Case in point, daylight savings change faces trouble in the house. Oh, what's he talking about? I'm talking about that thing we do every year twice a year, where we play make-believe as a nation, where we set our clocks back an hour and we go, wow, I slept in, I got an extra hour. No, you didn't. You set your clock back and everybody's playing make-believe. And then a few months later, everybody's like, I'm gonna put my clock forward and we'll all make-believe it's later. Ooh, it's a different time. No, it's not a different time. It's all make-believe and it's stupid and its origins are stupid and we need to stop. And lo and behold, someone in DC actually agrees that it is a bad idea. So Marco Rubio's putting this sucker up. He's saying, let's just stay on this time. Let, what is this? We're gonna stop flipping it back and pushing it forward. We'll just stay on this time. And oh my goodness, it passed the Senate unanimously. Unanimously in the Senate, everybody's like, yeah, yeah, let's just keep it on this time and we'll be done. Cause it's silly, it's silly. And we should stop playing make-believe as a nation. Well, guess what? In the House, it's having problems. You're having uh, representatives in the House say stuff like, I don't know, this is a good time. What with what's going on in the Ukraine? What? What? What What does the Ukraine have to do with us playing make-believe with the time in America? It's dumb. It's stupid. And now you're going, but hey, isn't, isn't this cause of the farmers? No, it's not because the farm is just so the little kids can get to the school and it's not dark. No, it's not about that at all. Daylight savings goes back to World War I in Germany. And some American was over in Europe and he's like, fellas, those Germans, they're all playing make-believe. They set their watches forward an hour. They're getting an extra hour of daylight. They're saving energy and they're gonna beat us in World War I. So we did it too, because we wanted to be like the Germans because they have such great ideas with their little mustaches and the pointy spikes on their helmets. It was a stupid idea and it didn't work. So we stopped and then, FDR in World War II was like, we should do that again. This is war time. We won't call it daylight savings time. We'll call it war time. So they did it for WW2 and it sucked then. So they stopped. And then in the energy crisis in the 70s, they brought this crap back. No one likes it. This ginormous game of national make-believe. I'm gonna pretend it's nine o'clock. I'll get more sleep. No, you won't. You just slept in and you set your watch back. You absolute moron. No one saves energy. No one saves anything. It's ridiculous. Thank goodness Hawaii and, and Arizona tapped out. They're like, you guys do what you want. This is dumb. We're not going to play or make believe with the clocks anymore. So you would think that DC finally came to their senses with this bill. All the senators decided to, to pass it. Now it's in the house and you got these morons like like Al Green in Texas saying, I need to see more empirical studies on that. Empirical studies on what? Not playing make-believe anymore? What do you want empirical studies on? It's stupid. It doesn't work. I don't know what else you need to know. And these are the people who couldn't wait to tell us uh, what to do just a few months ago. Hey, put this serum in your arm. You can't have a job unless you put this serum in your arm. Jab, 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 go, go, go. Well, what's in it? Are there studies? No, but you have to take it to live. What are you talking about? It's the crazy, oh, we have to give money to Ukraine right now. We have to give billions to Ukraine. Well, will, will we get receipts? Why are you asking all these questions? We have to go now. But it was, is, is something as simple as let's just stop playing make-believe with the clocks and the time. And let's just have one time and stop flipping back and forth. Oh, suddenly they're like, I need to see studies. There's a lot going on in Ukraine. Are you crazy? Stop it. 
This is why I don't like big government. Even when it's completely make-believe, it is a fairy tale that doesn't work. They insist on keeping it going.